Hi everyone. Uh, today it's Usman, and today I'm going to record a video tutorial on how you can use Amazon uh, SES or in other words, simple email service uh, to send emails uh, using Fluent SMTP plugin. A few days ago, uh, I published a tutorial on how you can uh, use Amazon SES and configure it using WP Mail SMTP plugin. Uh, but one of our community member asked that uh, we should do the uh, tutorial with fluent smtp plugin as well uh, because with uh, wb mail smtp uh, you cannot use amazon uh, keys in uh, with the free version uh, so with uh, fluent smtp uh, you can use uh, as uh, amazon keys in the free version as well with wb mail smtp you have to use the uh, raw smtp credentials for sending emails uh, but but by the end of the day the result is same uh, however, uh, let's see that how we can uh, do it using Fluent SMTP. The first thing is that you need to uh, purchase a domain name and set it up on Cloudflare. Uh, for that, I have already recorded recorded a tutorial, and uh, which I will link below in the description. After that, I have installed uh, a WordPress site uh, uh, using Cloud Pages and uh, then i will configure this domain in uh, amazon ses i am in my amazon dashboard I just search uh, uh, ses uh, from this search bar and you will uh, land in, on your amazon ses uh, window i am in the frankfurt region so if you verify any identity inside this region uh, you you will only be able to use it uh, with this region so I will uh, create a new identity uh, so that you can understand that how you can uh, create a new identity in uh, Amazon. By identity I mean you need to verify the domain. I will also select the uh, custom mail from domain and I will choose mail you can choose anything then I will click create identity. Once you click create identity Amazon will uh, give you some uh, DNS records that you will have to add to uh, Cloudflare. For this you must have a, a domain which is already configured on Cloudflare. So the first record is CNAME record. I will select CNAME from here. Uh, paste the record and also paste its value and run the proxy off. Then I will copy this value as well. Add CNAME and also copy the value and click save then I will copy the third CNAME we have to turn off the proxy for them alright we also have to add these uh, two other records for for mail from domain to work i will add the mx record because the type of this record is mx then i will copy the value and uh, amazon i think amazon did a mistake here like they made it a one complete record so it might be confusing for new users uh, because the value is this and the 10 here is priority so just enter the value and the priority should be 10 click save then copy the txt value txt and and save so once all of these records are added our identity should be in the verified status it's right now in uh, pen uh, verification pending it will take some time uh, but after that it will uh, all right it's already verified so our identity is verified now we can uh, use this domain and send emails uh, through this domain uh, so the next step is uh, we will use the uh, cloud pages one click login feature to log in inside our wordpress site i will install the uh, fluent smtp plugin and uh, we will see that how we can use this plugin to like send emails all right we will activate the plugin 
so you can click on configure fluent smtp i will skip this part because earlier i had installed wp mail smtp i will select amazon scs so here you need from email the from email should be from the domain that you have just verified like uh, help at wp dot net from name can be anything like cloud pages you can also select force from name okay uh, now you need uh, two things access key and secret key and region as well so the region should be uh, the same like it's frankfurt so you need to choose the same region uh, eu ireland eu frankfurt okay so to get uh, access key id uh, we will go to security credentials and uh, users we will create a we will add new user and we will only give pro programmatic access i will call it fluent smtp go to permissions and uh, we will select existing permissions ses oh sorry we will select existing permissions from amazon ses full access and sns full access we have to give these two uh, accesses to this key we don't need to if you want to add any tags you can add them uh, click review and just make sure that you have given access uh, full access to SES and SNS uh, create user and you will be given access key ID which you can paste here and then you will be given the secret key which you can paste here so once uh, everything is done just double check that uh, you have entered everything then click save settings so you can see that uh, amazon scs is successfully configured uh, well once uh, everything is configured uh, let's uh, send a test email uh, we will use the from email that we configured i will send it to my email address and go do a test so you can see that your email is successfully sent well i am seeing that they also provide uh, email logs as well in the free version so that's a good thing because with wp mail smtp uh, you don't get uh, email logs in the free version so if you have any questions uh, feel free to ask in the comment section uh, thank you